course, it's Labour councillors that are now under fire in a lot of media at the moment. Uh, do you think Jeremy Corbyn has a handle on Labour Party councillors up and down the country responsible for social cleansing? I think what is really difficult is that the, the Conservatives have created this perfect storm. I always knew when I was a councillor that this was what they were doing. They were devolving more and more responsibilities to councils and at the same time not backing that up in government grants because you know as well as I do, councils only have three ways really of, of, of raising revenue and that is through council tax, it's through business rates and through government grants. If 80% of that, you know, of the government grants are taken away, then and clearly it's going to have an impact on services, extending the right to buy to housing associations, even having the right to buy on social homes, is really, really difficult for well, local It's something Jeremy Corbyn said at Prime Minister's Questions, but then, yeah. of course, the extreme left, as it, as it should be known yeah. now, they criticise Labour because instead of uh, taking up seats in councils, they should be resigning en masse or breaking the budget. I agree. Councils, Labour councils should be making much more noise about the impact of the cuts, that they should be highly politicised. You can see, in, you know, if you look at it in a kind of sterile sense, that they are treading a fine balance between saying we're managing the best we can, we are good managers of this, but I think there will come a time, and that is very soon, when they're going to have to say enough is enough, we are not willing to change the face of local government anymore.